Hello, this is James Swanson, Sr., your bishop of the Mississippi Conference of the United Methodist Church, saying to you, if you just look right over my shoulders, you will see the beauty of the Mississippi Gulf Coast. The beach is a beautiful place, especially on today. As you can see, the sun is shining, a breeze is blowing, it is just wonderful. But come June 1st, we will enter into what is called our hurricane season. And that can be a time of great disaster, particularly on the Gulf Coast for us. But what we can do, not only for ourselves, but for other persons along this Gulf Coast, is to begin even now preparing ourselves for the disasters that might come. I'm here with Millie Jordan, our disaster recovery specialist, who helps us in those times of season, to talk to you a little bit about what we need to do to be prepared when disasters strike. Millie? You're right, Bishop Swanson. Uh, preparedness is so important, especially with the hurricane season approaching. The best help comes from those who are equipped for their role in assisting survivors. These preparedness modules help lead your church through being prepared as individuals and families, church leadership, are making plans to protect their facilities, and congregations planning for local church involvement in disaster ministry for the community. Now, in addition to all of this preparation that we're talking about, you can do something else, and that is to continue, even at this very moment, and uh, supporting those efforts for recovery of disasters that have already happened. I mean, for persons who are already being affected by tornadoes, by flooding, and all those kinds of things that are going on, you now, in so doing, uh, give us resources to help in those situations so that when new situations come, we'll have the resources to help as well. So we want you to be aware that when the sun is shining, all of this beauty is going on. Disasters are just around the corner. So make sure you do that. Financial donations are always welcome and are often the best donation. Because of you, the gracious givers in Mississippi and around the globe, the United Methodist Committee on Relief, also known as UMCOR, can provide grants to those impacted by disaster. And when you choose to give, know that 100% of your donations go towards disaster response. UMCOR can guarantee this because administration costs are covered by the UMCOR Sunday offering and by undesignated gifts. One of the ways you and your faith community can help is by participating in Connecting Neighbors. You can give to Mississippi by mailing checks to the conference office and designating them to disaster relief. You can also give online to UMCOR by going to www.umcor.org and clicking the red donate button and choosing U.S. Disaster Response. Volunteering and sending relief kits are also ways that you can be hope to others in times of disaster. Also, if you would like to get plugged in to news, updates, and ways that you can serve in disaster ministry, please click the link at the bottom of your screen and subscribe to Disaster News. And you've done it. Uh, not uh, just yesterday, but in times past. You've always been generous in your giving, not only of your time, your talent, and your resources, but you've been generous in trying to help your sisters and brothers in your neighborhoods, throughout Mississippi, and throughout the world, making sure when disasters occur, the Mississippi United Methodist people are there to respond. So keep up the good work. This is Nellie and I both telling you, keep up the good work so that people will know that when we say the power of we, we're not kidding, because we know what happens when disaster occurs, and we want to make sure that we're prepared. Amen, Amen. Nellie? Amen.